So if you know anything about makeup, uh, it's going to become kind of clear that I don't know a whole lot about makeup. There's just so many things, I can't keep it straight. So anyway, the first thing I use is this thing, and I just put it on my face. And then you're supposed to like highlight your face. Yep. And then I just use my finger. If you all have any tips or like YouTubers that you watch, let me know. I just didn't wear makeup. I didn't really wear it in high school. I also took a break from wearing makeup in college because I got concerned about like the chemicals I was putting on my skin. And I really only just started wearing makeup again actually because of these videos. Okay, so that does look it looks like it did something. Then the next thing I do is my eyebrows. I use eyeshadow makeup on my eyebrows. My friend who's a makeup artist says that bushy eyebrows are in. So that's good because I have no idea how to pluck my eyebrows anyway. Like I said, I didn't wear makeup, but I also decided I wanted to experiment with my shampoo. And I washed my hair with all sorts of things like baking soda, and almond milk. I one time put palm oil in my hair and that was kind of the end of experimenting with shampoo because that stuff was red and wouldn't come out of my hair. It just looked like a big greasy red mess. It was really dumb. And now I use shampoo again. Ta-da! And this is my favorite part. It's the eyeliner. This stuff is really old too so it's like I have to put it back in here like every two seconds to put more on it. The other thing I don't like about makeup is that it's really expensive and also it's not easy to figure out how to put it on. It's not like a skill that, that like women just have. It's hard. Okay, so the hardest part is the little wing at the end. Usually I just go for it and see how it turns out. Here we go. Eh? The problem is I'm almost out of the stuff, so it's really great. Okay, so the hardest part about doing my eyes is I am sort of blind in this eye. So doing this one is so hard. As it is, I'm kind of just guessing. Uh, <laughs> I think this would go a lot faster if I had makeup that actually was new and not super old. But this comes from my lack of wanting to... Well, I mean, part of it's just being lazy. I have to go to the store and buy it. But the other part is that it's just so much money. So I'm just gonna look at this one and try to make it match. My friend who's a makeup artist also says that the wings don't have to be twins. They are sisters. So if they're a little bit off, then it's okay. There they are. Then I use this organic mascara that my sister got me a year ago for Christmas. I forgot to use the, um, this thing is terrifying. I mostly don't use it because I'm scared of it. <laughs> I remember one time in high school, I was like a freshman and had never worn makeup before. I was in this choir of all girls for the most part. We had a performance at, um, I think the Joffrey Ballet or something. And the older girls were all doing our makeup before the show. And they're all like, look at Abby's lashes, they're so long. And all the girls came around and looked at my eyelashes and were like, wow, they're so big. And it made me feel really good. I don't know if you can see how long they are because I think this mascara is too old to work very well. Yay, makeup. So then I take this eyeshadow again that I put in my eyebrow and I sometimes put it underneath my eye. Here we go. And then I'm going to smudge it. And then the very last part, I'll sometimes put lipstick on. Oh, it's like all melted. Mm-hmm. And here's the finished look. <laughs> yep, so if y'all have any um, tips or tricks, let me know. Happy Vedith. Bye.